Good evening, Fit and Healthy family. Happy Resurrection Sunday again. So I am checking in for the third video in the series that I committed to doing. Look at my flowers, you guys. So I put the, the orange uh, carnations with the tulips and I trimmed the stems and I changed the water and they perked up but they're nearing the end of their life. But they look, they look really good, much better than they were looking. So anyway, on to the third um, immune system boosting, I guess, food. This is really, I guess it is a food. It's, it's a food or a supplement, depending on how you look at it. But the third one, the third great source of vitamin D is cod liver oil. And it is great if you don't like fish. Um, and it is an excellent source of vitamin D. You can get 448 international units or about almost 60% of what you need for the day in just one teaspoon of cod liver oil. Now cod liver oil, you guys, is special because it's been used for decades to treat uh, nutrient deficiencies in the areas of vitamin D and the partner nutrient vitamin A. Remember I told you guys how you need vitamin K and vitamin A for vitamin D to work. And so cod liver oil is a great source of vitamin A as well. It's so good with vitamin A, you can get 150% of your daily value in one teaspoon. So you gotta be careful. You don't wanna overdose on cod liver oil. So one teaspoon, maybe two is all you need for the day. Because with the fat soluble nutrients um, like vitamin D, vitamin A, vitamin K, Vitamin A in particular. Vitamin D, it's really hard to overdose on vitamin D because we don't get enough from the sun. Vitamin A, you probably could overdose because with it being fat soluble, one of your body's primary ways to eliminate it is when you go to the bathroom, um, when you have bowel movements. So, you know, it's not like you're having bowel movements all day. So water soluble nutrients like vitamin C, it's easier for your body to get rid of that if you have too much in your system. If you have too much vitamin C, you'll just you know, urinate more frequently to get rid of it. So that is it for what I'm sharing about um, food sources, uh, supplement sources of vitamin D to boost your immune system. So we talked about salmon in the first video. Next, we did herring and mackerel. And here we have cod liver oil. I make sure to take about two milliliters of cod, well, two milliliters, which is about a half of a teaspoon every day. I never miss a day with cod liver oil. And I've been especially cognizant of that since the shelter in place started and the coronavirus started going around. So yeah, I take half a teaspoon of cod liver oil. I learned it from great, great grandmother, grandmother and mom taught me the value of cod liver oil. So anyway, that's it for today. Um, as far as activity goes for me today, I did a yoga session with my coach this morning. And that was after I had Sunday morning service, which was amazing. And I did a walk, a long one, to take that time to decompress and video chat with the family and some friends. I think I walked about eight miles, about 20,000 steps. So I really got it in today. Hope this video finds you all healthy and more knowledgeable and sheltering in place peacefully on this lovely Resurrection Sunday. I look forward to speaking to you guys again tomorrow. Take care, bye now.